Yo, what's going on guys, Professor here, back again with another video. In this video guys, I'm going to be playing with this 2.6 Hog deck. And uh, yeah, to be honest, Hog is now like back in the meta, to be honest, in my opinion. Hog EQ and also 2.6. Uh, because of the, yeah, because that Dagger Duchess that got uh, like insanely big nerfs. And now she's like basically completely out of the meta. She's like insanely trash, to be honest. And Princess Tower is, yeah, all, like the best right now princess tower is the best tower ship and because of that hog is back in the meta and i guess ice spear is gonna defend this wow that was really good defense over there so yeah we're gonna play with the 2.6 and see how good it is or yeah whether it is back in the meta or not and uh, yeah if you guys didn't enjoy the video please make sure to like and sub so in the first game here we're facing giant prince with the void and the uh, phoenix so okay you got the normal prince as well so it's like giant double prince with a void really yeah, interesting. Uh, I'll just go for my musk, and then I'll go uh, ice golem, and then yeah, I have to go for the ice spirit as well. And that should pretty much clean up everything. Yeah, that should be pretty much clean defense. So uh, okay, and also guys, one more thing that I want to mention is that the evil Joe got nerfed, and now instead of spawning two goblins like every single time that it goes uh, underground and then pops up again, every time it. Uh, it used to drop two goblins, yeah, spawn two goblins, but they uh, removed that, and now it's gonna spawn only one goblin every time that it goes underground and then comes back up, which is, uh, to be honest, quite good, but in my opinion, they have to, like, remove the goblin spawn when the drill goes, like, underground. There should be no goblins, yeah, there, it should, it, it shouldn't spawn any goblins, in my opinion, but yeah, we have to wait and see how good and how trash it is, because at the same time, you guys remember the evil Batram when we saw the gameplay? Everyone was, everyone were thinking that it's going to be like the most insanely broken evo, yeah, in the game and of all time. But it turned out to be like insanely trash. So um, okay, I'm gonna go like this. Wow, that was that was a really satisfying defense to be honest. So uh, yeah, we have to wait and see, I guess. So let's go for the musketeer at the back, and he's gonna go giant. I'm pretty sure. So I'll just go cannon. I'm just scared of his void to be honest. Uh, yeah, there's a void. I'm gonna go ice spirit and then ice golem. I'll go another musketeer and uh, I guess I'm gonna go can as well because I really don't want that giant to connect to my tower. Gonna skellies, he's gonna zap, so I'm gonna go evil ice spirit and then ice golem. Wow, really, really clean game to be honest. He got like literally no damage. I don't know how he got that uh, like little bit of damage on my princess tower at the right hand lane, but yeah, we'll take the win right there. And yeah, really nice win against the. Uh, Giant Double Prince, Night Witch, Void, and I'll see you guys in the next game. I'm on the next game here up against uh, Ahu Do Do Do. So let's see who's he playing. Gonna go uh, skills at the back to cycle back to my Evo Skeletons and see what he's playing. Holy Mega Knight first play. <laughs> I'm gonna just go for the Musketeer. So just to see what he's cooking. And yeah, as you guys have realized, everyone, like, almost everyone is running Princess Tower now. Some people are running Canyon, and some people are still running Duchess. Which I think using Canyon kind of makes sense, because it's, like, still pretty much, to be honest, overall better than Duchess. But using Duchess right now makes literally no sense. Because it's, like, insanely trash. So I just go for the Ice Spirit, and we should be fine. Yeah, really good defense. I'm gonna go for my, okay, I wanted to go Skellies to counter that e -Wiz, but I'm gonna do this and this. And once we get, oh, I get the king tower activation, I'm gonna go skellies. I'll go log as well right now, and that is insanely clean defense. Yep, only one, only one shot from the elixir golem pop. No, I messed up the hog at a bro. I really hate it when I do that. When I go ice cream and then hog, and then the hog jumps first. But it's all good. I'm gonna go. Wait, he's down elixir, I guess. Let's go ice spirit, and that's gonna be a lot of damage for me. Wait, what the? What is he doing? He just. He just ate all of the damage from the musketeer and went back on in the back. Okay. Uh, I'll just go for my... I'm going to be ready with my can if he goes like Eagle but I'm going to just go Evo Skellies and they should... Okay, they're not going to clean up. I'm going to go Log, Ice Golem, and then I'm, I have to go for the Evil Ice Spirit as well. And that should be pretty much, yeah, clean defense. I'll go Hog as well, just to keep up my musketeer healthy and also force out something out of him. He got recruits. What is this guy's cooking? He got Mega Knight. He got recruits. He got Firecracker, Eagle. Um, 
Does it go cannon here? Skellies. And then I'm gonna go for the ice golem. Uh, ice spirit. I'll just go for my musketeer. I'll log as well. Yeah, I have to log. And then skellies. And that should be, again, really good defense. Wow. Defending with 2.6, sometimes it's insanely easy. And sometimes it's, like, the most difficult thing of all time. It depends on the matchup, to be honest. Like, defending against these type of decks, like, spammy meta decks, 2.6... It's insanely easy to defend uh, when you're using 2.6. So let's go for this, this. I knew he's going to avoid the cannon, so that's why I put the musketeer alongside the cannon. I'm going to go log, evo skellies, another musketeer, and that is, once again, really clean defense. I'm going to go hog rider. I want to go evo ice as well, but I don't really want to. I'm going to just, I'm going to fireball that. That's like an insanely good fireball value. And that should be tower down as well. Yep, we're going to take the win, I guess. 10 seconds remaining, there's no way for this guy to win, so yeah, he gave up, we'll take the win, and I'll see you guys in the next match. On the next game here, I'm up against uh, Saurav, so let's do the plane. Gonna start again by playing my log, yeah, I'm gonna just cycle my log, and yeah, he's running Duchess still, which I, to be honest, is not the best idea, so yeah, as I mentioned in the last game. So I have to go can as well. I don't really want to get damage from that Ram Rider to be honest. So, and wait, what the? I just go Ice Golem to kite the to kite the E Barbs. The Musketeer should help out a bit. Yeah, it does. And then I'll just go Skellies, and that is going to counter everything. Yep, they're dead. Okay, good start. Good start to be honest. Pretty much okay start, I guess. Not the not a good start because we don't have too much damage on this tower, but good start. So let's go Hoggerty here, and then Ice Spirit as well, see what he's going to do. So you can get Cannon Phoenix, Musketeer, Ice Spirit, with the Ram Rider, E-Barbs, insane. Yeah, I mean, like, not insane, interesting. Uh, I just log there to get, I'm gonna get two damage. I'm gonna eat that two dam two hits from the Musketeer and just go Ice Golem like this. Alright, so, okay, let's go Skellies in the back. I really wanna know what this guy's playing, to be honest, at the start. Like, before I do anything, like, crazy plays. Yeah, at first I want to, I really want to know what is he playing. Cat the Void as well, what the? Okay, let's still take that damage. I'm going to go for my, I want to go Ice Golem. I want to split my Evo Skeletons because I have Augred in hand. But because of that Barbarian, I can't because they're going to just go all in the same lane. And now it's a little bit late because the Skeletons at the left hand lane is going to pretty much die, I guess. And, uh... Wait, hold up, the right hand lane is gonna connect still. He doesn't have a small spell, I just realized. He only has void. He basically can't can't do anything about them. I'll just go musketeer the back. I'll just go for the ice bird as well. Just to freeze the tower. Ice golem. And yeah, that's pretty much GG's. We'll take the win and I'll see you guys in the next game. I'm on the last game here up against Mara Maraviloso. So let's see what he's playing. Gonna start the game by playing my lock. See what he's playing. So, uh, he got the Prince Tower as well. Okay, I'll just go Hog at the bridge. He cycled Arrow, so really good Hog. Because, yeah, he's down like 3 Elixir, and now he played another 5. So, 3 and 5 is 8, so right now I'm up like 4 Elixir. So, let's go Skellies, and then Ice Spirit, and then Barbar and then Ice Golem, not Barbarians. Ice Golem to Kai the Barbarians. And if I put a guess, this guy's running Lava Hound. Okay, I... Yeah, they're, that... <laughs> Skeleton Dragon's not gonna literally confirm it. So Musketeer the bag, and then I'm gonna just go hog it to the middle to kite the left hand lane Skeleton Dragon because I don't want to get damage on my tower. And you got Fireball, Fireball, Arrows. Okay, good. Fireball, air, fi Fireball, Fireball, Arrows. Yeah, that, bruh. Fireball, Arrows is pretty much okay matchup for the 2.6 because uh, they have to spend like 7 Elixir to kill your Musketeer. For fireball and wait what he got zap too okay yeah as, as i was saying fireball if your enemies running lava hound you're running 2.6 and they have fireball and arrows it's pretty much good matchup because they can't kill your musketeer easily and they have to spend like seven elixir just to kill your musketeer which is four but if they have zap then it's like pretty pretty much difficult matchup still it's negative elixir trade for them but it's still quite much difficult to win because yeah they can just go fireball zap every single time on top of your musketeer and yeah you still have to overspin to defend the lava pushes so uh yeah this guy's running all three of them which is insane i just don't know if that's going to be good for him or bad but we have to wait and see 
Uh, okay. Gonna go for my... He definitely doesn't have Tombstone, which is quite good for me. Because if they have Tombstone as well, it's a little bit difficult. So let's go Ice Spirit. He's gonna go Lava Hand in the back. Let's go Skitties. Mm, I don't really, I don't really want to go Hog right now. I'll just go for the Musketeer and then I'm gonna go Hog right I could have just go Ice Cool on my Hog. But yeah, at first I really want to cycle the uh, the Musketeer so I can cycle to her back again. Uh, once he kills this one. So let's go Ice Cool in front. Uh, log over there, skellies, and then I'm already back to another one. Yeah, as you guys saw over there, he just fireball and zapped the musketeer. So I'm, now I'm back to another one. Gonna go for the ice spirit, the ice golem. No, the inferno dragon is locked on, but really good fireball. Killed everything. Gonna go for my hogger now. See what he's going to do. I evo ice spirit as well. Gonna log everything, and then I'm gonna go ice golem as well in front of the musketeer. So he can't kill it. So yeah, he has to get. Like he gets forced to play something else. And then I'll go Skellies and then Hog. I'm gonna predict the Skeleton Dragons. Because he's yeah, that's the only answer in his hand right now. So he zapped as well. Not the best zap at his end. Gonna Ice Spirit 2. He went guards. It's all fine. I'm gonna go Log. And see what he's going to do. Pretty sure he's not gonna go Lava Hand. Because if he does, he's gonna just lose the game. Uh, he might Lava at the bridge though. That's like, yeah, that's what they do. Uh, I'll go Ice Golem. Wait, hold up. I'm gonna hog. No, I want to go hog, bro. I accidentally clicked the fireball. Okay, wow. He's gonna spam everything now. Yep, there we go. Uh, it's all fine, though. I'm already back. I'm gonna get back to another fireball pretty quick. I'm gonna wait for the lava hound to die. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna fireball. Bang! Really nice. <laughs> really, really nice fireball. And um, I guess I'll just go hog. And then I evil ice spirit. I'll just go for the log as well. And that should get a hit at least. Yeah, which is pretty big for me. And hold up, the musketeer is locked onto the inferno. It's gonna kill it. If it does, okay, zap. If that did kill the inferno dragon, it would have been like insanely good for me, but it's still all good. Uh, okay, I'm gonna wait for the lava hound to pop up again. And then I'm gonna go fireball. I'm gonna fireball now. Bang, once again, clean fireball. And that should be GG's. Really nice win over there. And thank you very much for watching the video, guys. And if you guys did enjoy the video, please make sure to like and sub. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.